Hello everyone. So today we are going to talk about another problem that is remove duplicates from a sorted list part two. Okay. So let us read the description. So given the head of a sorted linked list, delete all all nodes that have duplicate numbers. Okay. Removing only or uh, leaving only distinct numbers from the original list. Okay. So the key point is here. This delete all nodes that have duplicate number. Even if we have one duplicate, remove all the nodes. Okay. Example is this one one two three three four four five, okay. So this three is all all removed. Four is also all removed. So the resultant is one two and five, okay. And return the linked list uh, sorted as well, okay. So we need to keep the order as itself. Then we have another example is one 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 two three. So one 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 is removed. Only two and three is remaining, okay. And the constants are number the number of the nodes in the linked list ranges from zero to three hundred. Okay, the values can be ranged from minus hundred to hundred. Okay, the list is guaranteed to be sorted and it is in, in and it is in ascending order. Okay, so that is all about the problem. Okay, now let us see what is the approach that we are going to be using to solve this problem. So let us uh, understand the problem here. So what we are going to be doing the approach. The approach is very simple. We are going to be creating a dummy node or sentinel node. Okay. So that is uh, we are creating that as previous pointer, okay, and we will be pointing to that, and this dummy or sentinel node will be pointing to the head, okay. So dummy's head is uh, ha dummy's next is head, okay, and previous is pointing to the dummy, okay. Why we are creating this basically? We are creating this in order to store, in order to keep the track of the distinct elements only. Head will all will all be doing the uh, will all be doing the operations of skipping the parts, okay, and previous will be pointing and keeping the track of the distinct ones. Okay, as simple as that. Now, first, what we are going to be doing? Head is here. So, what I will be doing is instead of writing the whole P and all stuff, I'll be simply uh, writing P and H. Okay. So, previous is here, and head is here. Now, what we are going to be doing? We are going to be checking that head dot value is different from head dot next dot value. Yes, it is different. So, what we are do? We are going to be doing? We are going to be removing previous from here, pointing our previous here, and head will be pointing here. Okay, just moving both previous and header by one position. Now again, we'll be doing the same stuff. We'll be pointing. We'll be uh, checking that head dot value is different from head dot next value. Yes, it is different. So in that case, what we are doing? We are removing pointer from here. P will be here. Head will be here. Okay. So again, we'll be doing the same stuff. It is different. No, th this time it is not different. So we'll we need to skip this uh, three here. So what we'll be doing? Previous is here. Skipping all this. Uh, Three is here. Head will be head will be here. Okay. Now previous next will not be pointing to this. Previous next will be pointing to the head only. Okay. So uh, there is a uh, something like this. Okay. It will it is pointing to the here, but it is not moved from here. Okay. It's still there. Now again we'll be doing the same stuff. We'll be moving our head here. Okay. Head again will be uh, checking. Head will again be checking. Or oh, do we have any other values which are dif uh, so different? No, it is not having. So head dot value is uh, equals to this one. Yeah, it is equals to this. So again, we'll be moving this head. Uh, again, we'll be moving this head from this. This part will be skipped from here, okay? Because head value is there. So head is pointing to this point, okay? Now again, this head will be checking the different value. So head dot next is different. Head dot next head dot value is different by head dot next dot value. Yes, uh, they are different. So in that case, what we'll be doing? We'll be simply Uh, pointing this head from here to directly here. Okay, so uh, it is something like this: one, two, and then it is been skipped. These two parts, this two part, it has been skipped. And correction here: this point P is not pointing here. It will be pointing to the next. Okay, whatever the value will be there, it is pointing to here. It is not pointing to the last node. It is pointing to head dot next. Okay, so P dot next will be pointing to the head dot next. This is just a correction. So it will be pointing here, and after that, if it is uh, continuing and seeing, if, uh, do we have any other distinct ones? It is not having distinct duplicates. Are there still? So again, this pointing, this P will be pointing to the next one. Again, I'll be explaining this so that it is very clear. So just let me erase this stuff. Okay. So I will remove this one, this one, and okay. 
so uh, we have two pointers one is previous pointers one is previous and another one is head pointer now previous is keeping the track of the all distinct ones so head is is the front one okay now head will be checking that head dot value is different from head dot next dot value yes it is different correct so pointer p will be removed from here will be removed from here and header will also be removed from here so pointer previous pointer will be pointing here and header will be pointing here okay now again same stuff header dot next value header dot value and header dot next value are compared both are different so again this previous pointer will be pointing to this previous point this uh, two and head will be pointing here okay so i think this is you are getting the point now again we are doing the same stuff but this time you can see we are getting the duplicates so header dot next value a uh, header dot value is equals to header dot next dot value so in that pass what we are going to be doing we are going to be skipping this and again head will be pointing to the last node which is here okay the last node and this previous pointer this previous will be pointing to head dot next okay head dot next it will be pointing here now again this head will be moved here from here to here then again it is going to be continuing checking that head dot next value is different from uh, head dot value yeah it is uh, it is same basically so again this head will be skipped and will be getting your last point position now again we will be checking that head dot next head dot next value is different from this head dot value yes both are different so in that case what we will be doing we will be simply uh, first it is going to be pointing this this pointing this pointing will happen here but you can see we are getting distinct only so previous previous dot next uh, previous uh, will be equals to previous dot next okay so this is going to be simply pointing here at the last position here okay so the it will be getting something like this dummy will be there one will be there two will be there okay this three will be skipped four will also be skipped okay and directly five will be pointing here and last will be we will be having null here okay so this is the approach now let us see the code part for this now let us see the code part the code part is very simple okay so you can see we are creating a dummy okay sentinel node here uh, which is having the value zero and it is next pointing to the head okay dummy's next is head here now we are creating a previous node which is pointing to the dummy okay then we are doing the same stuff we are making sure that head is not equal to null so when it is not equal to null then we are doing the following operations first is the comparison this is the part where we are going to be skipping some values okay so what we are checking that head dot next not equals to null okay so that is the first check and the second condition is the head dot value if that is equals to head dot next dot value we have already seen that what we are going to do in that part we are going to be skipping those things so our uh, it will be simply skipping this so while we will be running while loop and we will make me sure that head dot next not equals to null and head dot value uh, head dot value basically same condition only if that is the case then we will simply head equals to head dot next simply moving the heads okay and once we are do, uh, at the last position of the uh, head okay at that position will be pointing our previous dot next equals to head dot next okay previous will be pointed to the head dot next okay and then we are um, this will the uh, head is also being moved okay so head is also being moved so head equals to head dot next now again uh, this is the first condition where we are meeting the uh, duplicate ones once we are not meeting the duplicate ones so in that case it is going to be getting into the else condition and what is going to be doing previous equals to previous dot next okay so previous equals to previous dot next it is going to be doing and then we will be simply returning the dummy dot next okay so this is the simple approach or the simple solution for that problem so thank you uh, guys for watching